my heart to you. Help me be ready to leave the world behind. To serve you, Lord. To serve you, Lord. Take the love I have for anything that holds me back. Redirect my path to you. Right, so what you just saw um, me applying was sunscreen to my face as. I am about to go outside to do some raking and you know Jamaica the sun very hot so with lupus I have to make sure that I protect myself in the best possible way and also the fact that I'm not supposed to be in the sun as much as I normally would so um, I promised to buy myself a big broad hat so when I'm on the outside I can have shade on my face from all angles but as it is right now I didn't remember to purchase it and I had to just make up this wear right now to just suit the moment alright cuz normally the three kids would do it but Two of them are not here, so it leaves the younger one. Mm. And I felt like I needed to assist. So I am in the process of assisting him with some raking. Alright, so yeah. And because it has been raining every single week my husband decided that he's going to hold off on cutting the grass because he don't want to do it several times you know or twice in a month because he's the one who started cutting the yard um, for several months now so yeah this is the thickness of the grass compared to when it's cut it's 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 a lot of grass and here goes the multi-purpose husband or as they would say jack of all trades This is just the back part of the yard. We don't touch the side part them yet and we don't grow on the front yet. So it's a lot of raking, but I'll see what I can do. When my body gives gives out, then that's it.
So it was at this point I decided to share the trees or plants that's in my yard. So here goes a planting tree with a nice bunch of planting. All right, you can make planting porridge, press planting, <clears throat> planting chips. Um, and when it's ripe, you can fry it or boil it and eat it. Yum, yum. All right, so yeah, there goes bananas and planting trees. There goes an apple tree and a mango tree beside it. That's East Indian. Both of them, I think, um, we got fruits from them twice. And here goes this lovely pepper tree loaded with ripe and green peppers. All right, so as you can see, they're of different sizes. Yes, some are ready for picking, while others need some more time to mature. Yeah. And it's been over a month since we have not bought any peppers in the market. So yes, this pepper tree has not failed at all. It has been providing us with peppers successfully. Yeah, and I think this is the second time it's bearing peppers. So here goes the smallest one. Yeah. And the beautiful planting and banana trees and we have another pepper right here because there are there are three of them in total so this is the medium size one and it only has one pepper on it the leaves are quail because they were surrounded by too much grass so yes there goes and here we have more banana and planting trees our yard is filled with them and we may be planting more too so yes all the way out to the gate we have tons of them mm -hmm. and this is another planting tree with a nice bunch of green planting yes 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 what's my favorite planting mm, fry planting and it must be just a tot ripen i don't like it when it's over ripe it sucks too much oil no i don't enjoy it like that when you just start ripening and it doesn't have too much stain in it yeah that's why i love it mm-hmm so here goes the beautiful flowers which is planted right in the corner wall of our gate i just love how they are so well stacked together and here we have some more this is this is stretched out alongside the longer part of the gate they are so beautiful and i tell you when they were just planted you could see space between them but the thing is they weren't planted far apart so you see as they grow they spread out and they just gel into each other it's like they lock into each other and this is why they are looking so beautiful because i've seen others and they aren't even nowhere near as beautiful as these because they are too spacious so if you plant them and they're too spacious and they're not gelled together like this and looking beautiful, replant them or add some more to the spacey parts. So when it starts to grow, it grows out and spread into the other ones. Yeah, beautiful. I just love them. When I'm outside and I'm looking at them, I feel so pleased. My, my husband did an excellent job with choosing where to plant these and right beside the wall it has um sand 
and gravel there so yeah it, it holds firm mm -hmm. and for those of you who have seen previous videos you see how big this mango tree I get it's growing oh yes it's growing and there was no planting tree there so that was recently added months ago so yes here are some more and husband still cutting the yard yeah there are two other planting trees that have shooted and so by the end of the year we'll see some more plantings coming out yeah to know that um hurricane burial which came to jamaica in july 2024 did a number on those um planting and banana trees and it's now october october 26 and to see how they have flourished since it's just amazing god is good you know and to also see that uh, they're bearing you know two of them have plantings on them and two others are shooting you know so yeah thankful and grateful and to actually see crops growing in our yard it's it's a good feeling because my husband is a true agriculturalist but i am learning as i go because it wasn't a thing of mine but i love seeing when other persons do it and it flourishes so as time goes by you know i'll show you a little bit more of what is happening with these um, planting and banana trees in the yard and whatever else it is that we are cultivating all right so yeah keep watching and don't forget to like share comment and subscribe i have actually taken a break from the raking because the sun was getting too much for me and so i had to leave that alone um as soon as the the sun subsides hopefully i can go back to assisting with the raking because as it is right now it looks like it's going to rain so i want to go inside cool off and start dinner i think i'm doing chicken foot pumpkin soup today for dinner and so yeah that's what i'm going off to start prepping for cooking
so divine And for your mercies I want to thank you Thank you for loving me 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 Show me all I have to change Let my, let my actions Be pleasing in your eyes I want to serve you, Lord And for your mercies, I want to thank you, thank you for loving me.
give you praise Cause that I am you decided to say My heart from the wicked raise No see so even though I'm not worthy For because you are God Almighty Oh, my God. 